Hey, what's up YouTube? This is the Mermail Master coming at you from the Team Time Riders YouTube channel with a video um, card review on a card that a lot of people may have forgotten about. And that is, of course, Magical Spring. Now, Magical Spring is a card that I'm planning on running in um, either one or multiples in my side deck within the coming formats, specifically if the Pendulum themes keeps up. Um, so for those who don't know what Magical Spring does is that it's a card that activates that allows you um, during either player's turn to draw one card or for each card um, that were for each face up spell or trap card your opponent controls and discard one card for each spell or trap card you control. So basically it's a draw engine for your deck if, um, that's pretty much live and allows you to go um, plus zero if your opponent's got pendulum scales out and then even more if your opponent does not um, has like multiple face up spell and trap cards but the real reason that I think you should run this card is because it's second effect which basically after it's activated you make your opponent um, all of their spells and trap cards are unable to be destroyed now I think Konami knew that with pendulums that there would be a lot of destruction of scales and stuff like that and destroying face up cards to get other cards into the thing so if your opponent activates uh you know they brick or something like that and then have two scales on the field that and they put them in with the intent to pop one chain magical spring draw one um draw two cards for their scales and discard one um the i guess drawback of that is that um before magical springs rev resolution that it itself counts as a face-up card on your side of the field so you will have to discard but on the plus side um, against your opponent it's a very very potent card um, lock down their scales if they have like you know a, a shanky magician and then something else they can't really use in their scales and you just lock out their pendulum summoning for a turn pretty much that would be enough for you to uh, be able to mount some kind of a carefully planned assault the next turn and win from that point out so basically punishing your opponent for trying to destroy their pendulum scales or for destroying other cards and can be an awesome, awesome uh, thing against um, some errant metal folks players as well. So uh, this has been a card review on Magical Spring. I really hope you enjoyed it and hope that you'll consider it to run in your extra decks or in your side decks or possibly even your main deck if it comes down to that. And yeah, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more great content just like this. Have a good one, guys.